We laid down on our rug. And after a while, when Michael reached under my skirt, I didn't stop him. Not then, and not when his hand was inside my underpants. I want you so much, she said. I want you too, I told him. But I can't. I'm not ready, Michael. Yes, you are. You are. I can feel how ready you are. No! I pushed his hand away and sat up. I'm talking about mentally ready. M mentally ready, Michael repeated. Yes. How does a person get mentally ready, he asked. A person has to think. A person has to be sure. But your body says you want to. I have to control my body with my mind. <laughs> oh shit, Michael said. It's not easy for me either. I know, I know. He put his arm around me. Look, we can satisfy each other without the whole thing. We will soon. If I didn't know better, I'd think you were a tease. I never tease you. Yeah, I know that too. You want me to be honest, right? Uh-huh. Well, the thing is, I don't know exactly how to do it. Satisfy you, I mean. It's the easiest thing in the world, Michael said, loosening his belt. <gasps> Romeo was wrestled, he was ready to kill. Jumped out the window because he couldn't sit still. He was waiting with the safety net. Don't bury me because I'm not dead yet. Why don't you tell me about the mystery? I want to know about the mystery. Do it. Why don't you tell me about the mystery? I want to know about the 